What is up gamers? How are you Doug Dimma doing? Today is another fail at gaming video and we have another review. Have you ever been playing Call of Duty Mobile on your mobile device and thought, hmm, hmm, what if there was something better to improve how I, uh, how I game? Well, here, let me, uh, open up this package and show you guys what you can get. This is a Chinese box. You actually can't read it, so I'll just have to show it to you. This is the GamePad keyboard combo. I think it's the P5 from Just Mobile Gaming. It's a site where you can get... Here, let me move the camera back. This is a site where you can get all your mobile gaming needs, okay? So let's open this first little part. What we have here is a connector, okay? This is for power. You have one, two, three USBs, and this is Bluetooth, so you link this to your uh, mobile device. Let's actually you have to turn on power first to do that. So here we go. Here I have a solution right here. We are going to use my uh, mobile charger, portable charger, whatever. Ugh, get that out of the way. All right, now quickly untie this. But this is possibly one of the best keypads, uh, keypad mouse combos, and you know converters that you can get for your mobile device for under fifty dollars. And right now the site is doing like a massive. Let's see. It turn on. There we go, and you guys can see it's blinking right now. That means it is ready to Bluetooth pair. So let's go here, we're going to go turn on our Bluetooth, I'll show you guys what it's actually called, because I feel like that's a crucial part of the video. It's already linked because I've already linked it once, I just followed all the steps, and it actually comes with these nice convenient steps. It does have English on one of the sides, right here, instructions for use, whatever. Shooting plus V3A is the name, you're going to want to connect to that. All right, let's get Call of Duty Mobile back up so you guys can see it again. And we'll keep unboxing. But as of right now, we are connected. Let's see what's in here. We have a nice mouse. Um, the only problem I have with this mouse is the clicks aren't really uh, pronounced. It's very quiet, and it kind of feels a little bit mushy. And for me... I'm not sure about that, but you can also swap it with another mouse. That's just a wired mouse that you can throw in with an incredibly long cord. Let's turn you this way so you can see a little bit more. Whoa, camera down. It's all good. All right, so now let's connect this over here. Lights up red, but it also is RGB. And it goes through all of the little cycles, whatever. And boom, here we have the keypad. So let's start moving some stuff out of the way. Start getting it all set up. Uh, this is one of my first times looking at it. I just had taken it out to make sure it was the right package. But that is it. So uh, let's plug this in. And as you guys can see, it's also got RGB. You can tap this to turn it off, turn it back on, and uh, on my screen, here, let's bring my screen over now, so you can guys can kind of get a little bit of an experience. So you might not be able to see it fully, but I do, if you guys can see the little dot, I do have a uh, show taps on. So, I'm sure you guys can see it by now. Moving down, space, 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 and it's over here, you guys can see it. I'm currently clicking space, and it is moving perfectly with it. So let me adjust this camera again. Ooh, yeah, messy desk from all the other videos I've been doing. Move this back, move this up out of the way, this all out of the way, move. That behind there, this mouse right here. And let's fix his camera once again. 
So, as you guys can see, I have mouse right here, and it's working pretty well. I think it's just my desk surface. It's pretty reactive, and I'm pretty happy with how that's working. Whoop, there's a guy. Now, this will definitely improve how you are doing things. So, hold on, let me pause. Alright, we're back. I just wanted to adjust that camera again. So, let's, like I said, guys, you can adjust sensitivity however you want. Mine is just really low. I haven't really messed with any of the settings. But you can set it to however you want. Of course, I have WASD for my movements, space for my jumping. I think I have shift for auto run. Left click is hip fire slash, you know, just like aim and fire. My right trigger is uh, my scope. And I think that's about it. I think C, yeah, C is crouch. So if you guys are needing to crouch, I believe B is to swap weapons with on the ground weapons. Crouch, crouch. Ah, uh, it's okay. Um, I do need to adjust my uh, sensitivity. But uh, honestly, I'm not seeing that much of a problem with the uh, latency, with anything pretty much. And you can always go into your settings and do a custom remapping of wherever you want your stuff to lay. Like for this, I had to do some setting adjustments just to make sure it was getting it perfectly like in frame and actually touching on it. Uh, space bar, that one was a little bit uh, too high. And uh, it comes with this on the uh, instructions. It lets you know what games they have that it works really well with. But I think it works pretty well, especially for a uh, cheap. Like this is pretty cheap. It doesn't feel cheaply made, but it's cheap when you buy it. Um, I believe they are running a deal though where you can get it for, I think, 20% off with the code. And I'll put the code down below so you guys can see it, or I'll just edit it in. Uh, you can save 20%, though. And uh, I think they already ha actually have a sale on it right now anyways. So I think in the end, if you were to order right now, you're probably saving around 30 to 40% on it so instead of being a $50 thing you're getting it for around 25 maybe 30 with shipping and that is such a great deal for this guys because there are not a lot of these keypad mouse combos with the converter that are cheap and actually work well so if I were you guys I'd pounce on it also you can swap weapons with two three um, I haven't figured out Oh, actually, there you go. I just did. Okay, two is to swap weapons. And if you want to uh, use your UAV, it's one. I need to figure out what four. Four has been unassigned. Five has been unassigned. Six is unassigned. F5, F1 through five, nothing. Uh, I believe if you click the massive T, it pops up with the map, which is cool. Um, you need to do a little bit of remapping where that's going to be at just so that you can uh, get it a little bit better. G is the auto run as well as shift. So uh, just expect that. X, nowhere. Z, nowhere. C is crouch. V, nowhere. B is the auto pickup function. So let me go try to find a gun on the ground to kind of just show you guys. Here we go, we're gonna auto shift. Oh, I'm still crouched. Boom, there we go, now we're up. But pretty much we're just looking for somebody to die so we can pick up a gun with B. Like I said guys, this of course is not exact how it would look. Oh, I think control, yeah, control is my special. So, if you're wanting just to go through Cause some damage. Oh, they're all up here. Alright, alright. Don't worry, don't worry, guys. Don't worry, I'm coming in. I got a grenade launcher. 
I have one left. I gotta make it count. Oh, no, we're back to our original. That's okay, though. Alright. So now that we're... Oh, okay, so we lost the round. It's whatever. I w that wasn't the point. But you can see clearly the double dots pop up right here. That is showing that will be the pickup. And, uh, yeah, I think this is honestly a solid kind of package deal. You're getting not only the converter that Bluetooth connects to most devices. I think it's all devices. I could be wrong. You're getting a solid mouse. Uh, adjust sensitivity in-game, though. That wasn't mouse performance that was affecting it. You're getting a keypad, which is perfect for this. If you're playing Fortnite, mobile even, this is a game changer. Call of Duty Mobile changer. It really is super solid, and you can remap everything on there. Uh, I just need to get it set up. You could even play Minecraft if you're still playing Pocket Edition. I don't know if you are. And if you want to, like, these next buttons down here, you can click C still. You just have to remember where you mapped it out. And it works really, really well. So, I think that's not going to be it. But, like I said, guys, go down to the links in the description. Go down to justmobilegaming.com. You guys can pick this up right now. Use code SAVE20 or whatever the code is. I'll be putting it down, you know, bottom of the screen. And you guys can go pick one of these up for yourselves. Like I said, at this point, with their discount and the savings, you're probably going to get it for around $20 to $30. Super, super, super affordable. I think it's really well designed. I like the RGB. It's a nice little start, especially if you're trying to game on a budget. I would definitely recommend this. And it works with, I think, all devices. So there's really no cons to it. It's nice and minimal. So if you have limited desk space, maybe you just don't have a lot of room for a full like keyboard and mouse setup for your thing. Maybe you'd want to just be better than your friends. Definitely use this. I highly recommend it. All right, I think that's going to be it. Thank you guys for watching. And I hope you guys decide to go and buy one of these. And, uh, you know, maybe I'll catch you guys on Call of Duty Mobile. I don't know. Thank you for watching, though, and uh, have a great rest of your day. Don't forget to follow my thumbnail artist who did such beautiful thumbnails as this one and this one, which is actually in this video. But, like, go follow him, guys. Links in the description below. I guarantee you guys will not regret it.